What is up, Perfectly Average Golfers? Welcome back, or for the first time, to the channel. We have a treat today. We've been traveling a bunch. I know a lot of you guys have been commenting about it. Playing in Columbus, playing in Toronto, playing in Vegas, and now we're in Boston, Massachusetts, playing what I believe is actually one of the older, if not one of the oldest courses um, out here in the Boston area, which means it's one of the oldest courses, I believe, in the United States. It's really close to where the country club is uh, out, out in Brookline. So we're playing the George Wright Golf Club. Um, it's super cool, man, and it just, it's absolutely pure out here. There's something about it where it just feels super historical. So I'm really, really pumped to get out there. We're playing the tips. It's the blue tee box markers out here. It's 6,400 yards, playing a par 70, and the slope in the rating is actually actually very average when it comes down to the overall difficulty. So hopefully we can put up a pretty solid number today. There's no driving range, so we're gonna be swinging easy for this first hole. It's a 394 par four. Still gonna be driver, nice easy swing. Let's get at it, boys and girls. You're gonna take an easy nine iron, just trying to keep things moving. Let's see. Stay there. Hold on, ball. Oh, bunky. Just push that off to the right. Not bad. I'm gonna put the camera down here. A little bunky test. Let's go. Nice shot. Thank you. I will take that a little long. Didn't quite get the sand where I wanted to, but it's out. Oh, Ooh. Nice okay. How about that for an up and down par? Oh, Holy! <laughs> All right, that's a great up and down. We got hole two coming up. It is a 364 par four, pretty much straight on. It actually looks a lot shorter <laughs> than what the card suggests it is. Uh, so we're not gonna pull drive here. We're just gonna pull out three wood, keep something nice and straight and up the fairway. Hopefully get a nice little look to get on into again. Let's go, baby. Great start. Center fair way better than that. Ah, position A. <laughs> All right, we got 117. I'm gonna take 54 here, helping win. Just nice, easy stroke. Hold off the foul through, just touch. See if we can get something to get up to pretty close. Let's see. Whoa! Right on line. Let's go, baby. Thank you. I just kind of stayed out there. <laughs> Little par par start there for the boy. Really like that two putt as well. I got really close, I think, to reading that correctly, but such is life. We take the two putt pars and now we go on to our first par five. It's up the hill, playing about 560, 520, something in there. Uh, the production package, of course, will tell you. Uh, we're gonna have to bring the driver out here. Um, we'll see exactly what kind of ball flight we're gonna be playing today. The three would be hit really, really well, dead straight, but I have a feeling the driver may not have the same thing in mind. Let's see, let's go get it. Dude, what is happening? <laughs> All right, it's getting a little windy right now, so I've got 276 left. We're going to take three wood. We're definitely not going to get there. Just looking to keep something hopefully under the wind. Big old hook. Again, still pretty windy out here, so I'm just going to speak from behind the camera. Uh, we got about a 120-yard shot. Wind, again, is pretty much dead straight on. I'm going to try to flight a 50-degree. Uh, hopefully, keep it underneath this top branch. Ah, uh, straight chunk. All right, up and down for par. <laughs> All right, got a little feel shot here at the 58. Not really sure where we're at distance-wise, but... I'm gonna try to get it up there, hopefully produce some spin, we'll see. Yep, 
Yep. Wow. Look at it, just keep going. I know. <laughs> Well, an unfortunate chunker gets us our first bogey on the card, but hey, not bad overall, actually. Outside of the chunk, all those shots actually were really solid. Uh, we got our first part three coming up. Uh, it's 170, but playing about 160 with the slope you're about to see. Uh, we're gonna take a little bit extra here, just play a nice easy eight iron, just because I'm not really sure what the wind is doing, and uh, better long than short it looks like on this hole. So, let's go. Oh, it's got to go. Deceivingly downhill, this green. Yeah. Oh, we take hard. It's just nope. Oh. Oop. You good? Can't believe I just pulled that. Oh, no. Come on. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> Tough little pull there for the bogey on a par three, which I never love, but hey, three putts happen. You can't escape them all the time. We got a par four coming up, dog laid to the right, 412, and it looks like you can actually take some pretty heavy space off of this. Um, I don't really trust the fact that I, I don't know where the line is with drivers, so we're gonna take three wood and kind of just take it uh, just to the, the furthest right that you start to see the fairway. A lot of heavy wind coming at us, so hopefully audio is okay. Let's go at it. Yeah. Right, once again, the wind is kind of coming pretty hard right now. So uh, we got about 160 shot, but it's playing down to a really sunken in green. It's about 150 or so to the pin. So with this hurting wind, I'm still going to hit a 160 shot. Got eight iron. Let's see. <laughs> the peanut gallery, ooh, in harmony. <laughs> That'll work out. A little right of the pin, maybe a little bit long, but uh, I like the way I hit it, like the way we flew it, like everything about it. Let's go. Uh, let's go. Oh, didn't want to come back left. Huh, all right. Bruh. Stay down there. All right, next hole up, pretty big par four, about 400 yards. A uh, little bit of a zigzaggy fairway. We got driver, Let's see if we can hit straight. and skip the driving range more often. <laughs> Hercules, Hercules. <laughs> right, we got about 120 here with some helping wind. I'm gonna take 54. Okay, so this green looks to be pretty bold going down towards the pin. It's a back pin here. So we're gonna take a pretty full swing here with 54. Good contact, let's go. Let's go, let's go. Well, hopefully it comes left. Yeah? yeah? Let's go. Get in the hole. <sighs> want to do. Stop. Sit there. Sit, sit down, boy. <laughs> Unforgiving green, dude. I just straight pushed it. Oh, that's, that can't happen. Okay. <laughs> okay. Two, three putts today. None of more. No more of that. All right, boys and girls, that's a tough three putt. Two in a row for the for the camera, we love that. Hole seven, uh, 400 yard, par four. Uh, interesting kind of blind tee shot here. It goes pretty straight, a little dog way to the right, but the line is pretty much just to go straight at it. So you're not gonna see too much fairway here from the camera's point of view, but it's driver and hopefully straight. Is that too far right as well? Uh, they'll be safe, I don't know you. 
Actually, you might have gone just over there, T-Box. All right. All right, we're in play. We kind of have to chip uh, something up, though. We got like 140. Got to keep it underneath this tree. I got four hybrid. Just try to chip it up the slope as best as I can. A little plinko off the mounds, but we'll take that. I, know, I think we need to dye this in the fringe. Let this thing roll down. Yeah, let's see. Short game has been a little bit weird today. See if we can put something close. Oh yeah. Oh, you know. Wow, yes. That's exactly how we wanted it. <laughs> Sorry, did you want something close? Yeah, I wanted okay. something close. Alright. All right. Alright, that's good. Mm -hmm. Man. How about them punts? Putting on a putting clinic today. You can uh, leave your comments below. I will be happy to evaluate your short game. <laughs> we got a hole number eight, part three, pulling about 170. Wind is kind of swirling off the right more than anything else. So I'm going to hit the true number here, play a seven iron. Um, it's going to kind of go right at it. It's going to be a nice full swing though, because we don't want to be short. Long going to be fine. Um, and the pin, I think, is kind of in the middle. So this number should be good from both those distances. Let's go at it. Big draw like that. Out of nowhere. Yeah. Oh well. Alrighty there. We had a drop. I couldn't find it in this fescue over here, so drop two, hit three. This is a lot of squishy, thick grass. So here's hoping we get something up there close. Ah, uh, didn't get up on that platform. Just came out, pushed it right a little bit. It's gonna be a really tough putt from there. I can already tell you, I know some of you guys are already going to be talking about the putting game. <laughs> I get it. It's not great. It's not ideal. That's for sure. Um, but we'll see kind of what happens as we keep going through. Who knows? Wow, what the bounce? Yeah. I think just... <laughs> yeah, turbulence no on that putt. There, man. Ah, that one hurts. All right, there, perfect average golfers. That one's gonna hurt just a little bit with the drop, and then obviously not the greatest putts in the world, not the greatest chip in the world. That's a double, I believe. One more to play here. We got to get out of our headspace when it comes to missing some of these putts. We could have probably had a handful of strokes back. I'm throwing my clubs all over the place. Such is life. We move on and try to finish off this first part. Maybe it was something under a par. That'd be great. We'll see. All right, final hole here on the first part. Par four, playing 450. Big boy. Big boy. Let's see, we'll try to get there in two, obviously. That's kind of the goal in par fours. Uh, we got driver dead straight away. Let's find out. Take that. Woo, let's go, baby. That was gonna be down, there's a way. Right, we got about 170 left. That was a great drive. Actually, the fairway fell off real fast. So, happy to be in the middle. Hopefully, happy to be on it too. Let's find out. Oh, yeah. Sit, 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 sit. Oh, you're good, bro. I thought that was a lot longer than it was. Yeah. Caught that thin. <laughs> Honestly, it's a great putt. I'll take that. <laughs> I think I've dropped like four strokes just from putts no. today. I don't want to hear about it, comment section, all right? <laughs> I don't want to hear about it. All right, the Perfectly Average Golfer is doing a quick little outro for the first part here at George Wright Golf Club. It's plus eight with a lot of putts taking up most of where those bogeys were. So hopefully we can kind of clear up the short game on the putting green in particular as we get in towards the back nine. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Uh, I guess it's a par 70 course, so we would like to try to keep it close to 85 if at all possible. Actually, it should be close to 83 technically, but we'll see. We're gonna go right under the back here. So come by through, sub if you haven't. If you're back, good to see you back. And until next point, well, of course, make sure you step perfectly average. Bye-bye.